right, all right. We'll be there right away, Jakaro. Just don't tear the limbs off of anything. Or anything else. Hey, it's good that you're here. Our friends are eager to get started. Get started with what, exactly? Colonel Derek, Darth Arcus, and the Revanite friends. Since your operation on Manan, Lana's uncovered a few more Revanites who've infiltrated the Republic military. I've been slicing the traitors' communications and tracked the messages back to Derek and Arcus. They're in a hidden facility on the planet Rakata Prime. That's our target. Do you think the Revanites know you found their hideout? No, not yet at least. That's why we need to move quickly. The messages I've decoded. That cyborg technology you ran into on Manan was just the prototype phase. On Rakata Prime, they're in full production. They're taking pieces of the Star Forge and implanting them into their own people. The Star Forge? It was a Rakatan weapon. A giant self-sustaining factory that ran on the dark side of the Force. Revan destroyed it 300 years ago. The pieces of debris are still active, though. They self-repair and even self-replicate under the right circumstances. With that technology grafted to their bodies, the Revanites become much harder to stop. I'm surprised they have so many volunteers. It must be a painful process. They're insane cultists obsessed with the past. Giving them a chance to literally put pieces of history to themselves and become nearly unstoppable? There's probably a waiting list. Jakaro's freighter should get us onto the planet's surface undetected. We'll plan our attack from there. I can't wait to see the look on Arcus and Derek's faces. Alright, and we're back, guys. Let's play Star Wars The Old Republic. Uh, Shadow of Revan Prelude. So, yeah. Now that I'm just going to say this already about the smuggler, the smuggler, el uh, smuggler character will be going into a romance with someone. Uh, I'm not sure with who just yet. Maybe Lana Benico? I don't know. But yeah, we'll see. <coughs> Do we have a plan ready? I don't know if it's fair to describe it as a plan, necessarily. I've done a bit of scouting. The Revanites are camped in the Temple of the Ancients, an old ruin nearby. We've gotten this far without being detected. It's time for you to go in and make some noise. What?! This isn't what we discussed! It's suicide! I demand that you detach me this instant! What kind of security do the Revanites have? They've convinced some of the local Rakatan tribes to patrol the areas around the temple for them. A truly barbaric lot. The Revanites themselves are guarding the temple grounds. They're fully armed and paranoid. Wonderful. We'll be keeping an eye on things from the ship. As long as we all stay sharp, we'll get this conspiracy shut down permanently. May the Force serve you well. Really, really wonderful. <laughs> I actually feel sorry for the droid. Oh well, here we go. Here we are, and here we go. Now I'm just gonna say this already about the this character, guys. I am going to keep recording until we actually finish. Uh, the uh, Rakada mission and Shadows uh, Forge Alliance is part 3, so yeah. This will either be a really short or a really long vid. There we go. Enough! 
go. Now I will actually do some research. You'll have to head along the beach and straight through Rakata Central. Sorry. Right, now I will do some research about the um, uh, smuggler on uh, and all of the romance options. Because I actually want to see how far I can actually get with the characters that are actually in uh, Knights of the Fallen Empire. Because um, if I can get my smuggler, for example, with an Imperial character, uh, well, we basically with an Imp uh, companion, uh, for example, Imperial companions that we can that uh, actually came back. Uh, if I can, for example, get my smuggler together with a uh, vet, that would be really awesome. Or if I can get my uh, smuggler with. Um, Leo, that will also actually be really great and funny. Just to get, just to spice things up a little bit. You know? Actually, we'll be seeing if I can get, how far we can actually get in that uh, area with. Done. But yeah, that all actually will have to be for Knights of the Fallen Empire. And if you can't, then I'll basically just romance Lana Benico. Smuggler Lana Benico. Looks as though their arena needs a challenger. If you're going to get past them, you'll have to give them a show they'll never forget. Well, to be fair, I actually don't like that idea. Actually, if I have my smuggler. Romance Lana Benico. Alright. Here we go. Sure, droids in here. Because you can actually knock the droid, lock the droid outside of this fight. Yeah, this if I have to pick the longest fight uh, for single stuff, I have to say that probably maybe the rank or fight. This one right down here. Oh, there we go. We just got that uh, brand new ability kicking in. What was it? What was it name's name again? Uh, accelerating victory. Thank you. 
right? Done. Just keep doing this. If I'm being a little bit too quiet, guys, that's mainly just because I'm focusing myself all on my skills. Because I don't really want to proc the this one a little bit too soon. Because that actually allows me... Uh, Sensors are showing a lot of movement in the temple. The Revenites are mustering their defenses. Derek and Argus are in there somewhere. Just keep moving. It actually allows me to increase the damage by 5% per stack and stacks up by 2. So yeah. Oh my god, really? What? What the hell? Right, yeah, no, I re think, I really am pretty sure that there is a button in the options I actually need to press in order for me to close those tabs with the, the ES key. The ESC key. So, yeah, the escape key. Really neat. To, you know what? References. Not key bindings. Interface. Multiple filters to enable something else. Hold oh, on, what the hell? Uh, yeah, sure. Should the old tooltips, thank you. Yes, that on, please. No, oh, yeah, yeah, I actually uh, get that one on too. Well, text and don't really need it. Uh, yeah, sure. Hold on, hold on, all right. What was that last one? I could have sworn it was. Uh, I could have been when using cargo hold. Oh, wait, outfit on what the outfit modification. Abilities. All right. Yeah. No. Fine. And I guess. All right. There we go. Thank you very much for a knockback. And double kill. Well, actually, just a uh, single kill. The droid did kill the last one. God damn it. Oh, great. I'm depressed. Look. Done. Yeah, I actually activated that one a little bit too soon. Oh, well. Ah, god damn it. Didn't mean to activate that. Mainly just want to keep that still in reserve for me to get that uh, merciless ability thingy. Well, actually, I'm going to be switching around these two abilities. Overheard some revenants near your position. So same uh, with those two. Weapons. I want to do something about that. Yeah, Yeah, that's actually a lot easier.
right. Now, about, uh, well, basically, actually, this is a little bit too late for me to say this. Because whenever I'm going to be uploading this vid, it's actually going uh, to be the end of the week already. And for me, for you guys, so, for, and for me, it's basically will be tomorrow, Wednesday, so yeah. But I'm just gonna say it if, uh, in case I actually can't upload anything on, uh, Wednesday. Sorry for if I didn't upload anything on Wednesday, but it'll still be uploaded at the next day. For you guys. But sorry if it did if it did happen. But yeah, they basically will be coming for me tomorrow. For you guys, it was Wednesday that they basically came for me. Uh, they basically came to uh, clean uh, the couch actually. Because uh, one of our cats actually did pee on it. So, yeah. Almost did it again. So yeah. Should have actually said that on the Empire at War episode that I was actually recording, but yeah. Actually slipped my mind. Or maybe on the first episode of uh, Swotor. Yeah, anyway. Slipped my mind and I totally forgot about it. So yeah. Jump, jump, jump. Pull out the lightsaber, and I think we may perhaps yeah, just be over. Party for you. More of those and I think we may perhaps just be over 30 minutes whenever we finish off uh, this episode. Here we go. Still getting used to having a uh, saber ward above uh, uh, this. Dispatch. Yeah, it's dispatch. First, I almost actually said uh, vicious throw. <laughs> Get that back up. Should I actually? You're done. Oh my god! Please, can you please just stop doing that.
Wouldn't mind getting some backup guys. Really wouldn't mind it. There we go, Jesus Christ, Commander Rand. You're being on you were annoying. And you guys can fill that in. And open a channel there. I'll be able to slice into their systems remotely. Right. Here we go. Excellent work. Theron is slicing into the facility's structural plans now. It's not looking great. Your only option is to pass through the conscription center, dead ahead. The cyborgs ahead are in some kind of standby mode. They'll activate as soon as you enter the room. Be ready for a fight. Blasted sensors. Lana, could you do a quick perimeter check? I can't tell if these contacts are real or not. Right away. Alright, we don't have much time. We can't risk any of the tech in that conscription center falling into Imperial hands. Overload the console. It'll fry everything inside and kill the cyborgs before they have a chance to wake up. And here we go, guys. I'm going to press again to roll a few times. And it's a 5, which means light side. God damn it. We're not going to murder people in their sleep, Darren. We'll take our chances. We've got a Sith breathing down our necks, crazy cultists all around us, and you want to take chances? I won't let fear guide our actions. Do we have something to be afraid of? Apparently not. I'll add the sensors to the list of things on the ship that we can't rely on. We'll contact you if anything else comes up. There we go. I was actually hoping for a dark side action down here, but yeah. I'm about to break your record, boss. There we go. We're seeing movement on the temple roof. Might be Derek and Arcus trying to make an escape. Looks like they've got a shuttle. We can shoot her down if we have to, but I'd rather take them in for questioning if you can. Hurry. And I failed to do that this, so bye bye stealth option. And you're dead. Right. Now then, don't fail me down here, stealth option. Gonna wait till force camouflage comes off cooldown, and then we're just gonna go straight through it. Right. And this time I'm even gonna be pre manually pressing it. There we go. Now down here you can actually just have Kira kill everyone if you really want to or your companion whoever the hell you want to have with you. Wait for us. Please try to headbutt them with your own skull this time. Let's go. Your plans are finished. 
The conspiracy ends now. My, but we have a very high opinion of ourselves, don't we? This project would have accelerated our plans considerably. Losing it is regrettable, but it will not stop us. You've done a fair bit of damage, it's true, but the project isn't a total loss. After all, you've helpfully delivered yourselves for slaughter. You've infiltrated the Republic and the Empire, raised an army of fanatics. Why? What are you trying to achieve? We have a plan. You're not a part of it. That's all that matters now. You and your simple-minded beast will have the fight you came for, Colonel. Let's get on with it. All right, so yeah, Kira, go get him. <laughs> As I am still doing We're stuff. We're finishing this here and now. I don't really wait. need to do anything. Let's just, I'll, I'll just, I'll, I'll just let Kira and the droid handle the, un handle them. They can easily handle them. I have you now. Nah, I'm just joking. But look, <laughs> he's already at eighty <laughs> percent. What the hell? Also, Jakaro, really, do you use the droid's head as headbutt? Yours, Derek. Uh. You have them, Arcus. <laughs> and here we go. Marcus. They're yours, Derek. Really, dude, just stop force choking me for God's sake. What the <laughs> hell? You think you'll walk away from this? There we go. Activate all of these you abilities. Nothing. Cast that on you, spread the love dots around. Impossible. It can't Level be. up. Nice. 66. Hold on, did we just level up? Nope, we just only leveled up once, huh? No, two times, I think. You're dead. The hell? Okay. Take that. I mean, I know it's double XP, if I remember right. Yep. But still, Jesus Christ. You're dead. You know what? I'll actually will have to look uh, that up later on in the vi uh, when I'm editing this vid. You gotta do better than that. You have no chance. No. There we go. The plan. Ah, uh, Jakaro. Derek and Arcus fought to their last breath. We won't be getting any information from them. Copy that. Blast it. I must agree with my master. They're far more trustworthy as corpses. I sense something. We're in danger. Multiple sensor contacts. Capital ships are dropping out of hyperspace. No IDs. One of them's coming in hot. Arcus and Derek were valuable allies in my cause. But their deaths will not delay what is coming. That voice. It's him. Revan. 
My infinite army could have achieved so much. But I still have other weapons in my arsenal. The Republic freed you. Why would you betray your rescuers? The Republic is too weak and unfocused to do what must be done. To achieve my goals, all distractions must be swept aside. My followers are legion. My ranks grow every hour as more and more people see the truth of the galaxy. The Emperor couldn't break me. Even death could not stop me. I will finish what I've started, and you will not interfere again. They're powering up weapons! Get out of there! Now! Anyway, thank you guys all for watching. Hope you all actually enjoyed uh, this episode, and I'll see you guys all next time. Of course, I'm going to be finishing off all of this, but I won't be using any commentary for these two mi last two missions, basically. So yeah. Theron, they made it. I knew it. With the amount of fire Revan's ship was laying down, I wasn't optimistic. It's good to see you. <laughs> oh no, I'd nearly forgotten. Several of my internal components were still aboard. The ship is all right, isn't it? The ship is fine. Come see for yourself. There's something we need to talk about, actually. It truly is a relief to see you safe. I only wish we had more time together. What's going on? Are you leaving already? It's for the best. Theron and I learned some... troubling things after we escaped Rakata Prime. But Jakaro took the news better than you'd think. Have you told him? I think it's best if you do the honors. We'll meet again soon. I'm certain of it. She's pretty confident for someone with a bounty on their head. Are the Revenites putting out bounty contracts now? Not directly, no. It's an Imperial contract for murdering Arcus. Under any other circumstances, she would have gotten a promotion for that kind of thing. They also arranged 12 separate death marks for Jakaro. That's a new record for him. And you? Disavowed rogue agent apprehend on sight. Pretty tame compared to the others. The director must have stood up for me. If you know the director, couldn't he tell you who's behind this? I checked. The evidence of my imaginary crimes came in from our eternal security division, all very well forged. He'll keep looking, but we can't risk more contact. The Revenites haven't been able to touch you yet. Your record is still clean, but it won't stay that way if you're seen working with us. Lana, Jakaro, D4, and I are all going off the grid. We need to stay hidden if we're going to continue our investigation. No contact 
period. What can I do while you're in hiding? There must be some way I can help with the search. There is, actually. The Revenites will be watching you, so do what you do best. Travel the galaxy, achieve impossible things, and make it hard for them to keep up. The busier you keep the Revenites, the easier it'll be for the rest of us to slip through the cracks and find their leader. Do you think the masked man who attacked us was really Revan? Oh, you mean as my ancient ancestor returned from the grave to kill us all? Doesn't seem likely, but there was something about him. We need to learn more. All right, I better get moving. The faster we start running, the easier this will all be. Good luck to you. We'll send word as soon as we have something. And then we'll see what this Revan guy is really made of. <laughs>